Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jane, not Janet or Jeanette. It's Jane. And uh, today's video is gonna be like a small January update where I, I'm just gonna talk about my organization. Uh, my, I mean the way how I keep my stuff. And so this video is all about tidying up. This is a nice video for you to actually motivate you to uh, move and and clean up your desk because that's what I do when I watch other video where they actually clean desks and start organizing things and it actually made me do the same thing uh, which inspired me for making this video as well and yeah, I'm gonna share a few couple things and how I organize my stickers and uh, some tips maybe and my latest rag from my IKEA. This is for like a run out for my guinea pig because one of them always runs out on its own and he would just like run all over the place. So yeah, this is specially made for him and I really like this check it uh, little rug that I got from Shopee and uh, yeah, it's very nice, totally like makes the whole space stand out and this is, I guess this, it looks perfect here but not here, it's a mess here I changed my mind, I'm gonna change this I think it, it's, it's nice, the color is nice but it looks a little bit weird Ta-da! Done! So I bought this recently and it's actually glow in the dark. Um, I was thinking to give out those who actually purchase my uh, merch, which is, which, is uh, which are my postcard set and my tote bags. It's done. So this is gonna be my comfy uh, zen area. <laughs> so if I were to journal, if I want to sit here to journal, I could just put my essential oils and candles and yeah, and as you create the mood so that I could actually journal. Yeah, I'm very happy with this area. And I also include my uh, Aesop hand cream
is I was cleaning my gouache pin and then I found one of the color actually like molded. I don't know, but ew, look at it. Do you know why is this happening? And the rest seems fine. I just kept them like usual like in there and I don't know it's just only this color seems to be what color is this? I think it's like dark blue but yeah you I'm gonna throw this you and I actually need to do that, and it's very, very simple to do. Okay, so what you've got to do, um, obviously if you've left water, you can clean this first, put the water in the water. Hey Lulu, I'm trying to film here. Look what he's doing. And this is my um this is little area here. These are like storage boxes which is totally foldable and at the moment I'm just um keeping my stocks like um you see like um my tote bags, my packaging, and um, yeah, and I really like this part here because I get to put in all my plants again. And this is like the brightest area of this house. And yeah, they're gonna be here for a while. And I do have more plants in the balcony and there. Yeah, so usually I would like. A week I would rotate them to put out for the real sunlight and rain environment and then I wish like when they're done like a couple of days then I would actually move them here and this is my the Beatles poster that I've been using for so 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 many years mic stand that I have because uh, it's black and uh, to make it look less boring and interesting so I kind of like tape it up with any washing tape that I have 
This is totally random, like things that I couldn't stand. I wish they have white or in different colors, or I wish I have a uh, neon pink uh, washi tape left, but I do not have that. And the only colorful washi tape that I have would be this. So, yeah, and I didn't want to spend more money on new stuff, so I just use whatever existing uh, tape that I have. And yeah, so it look less boring now. Ta -da! So this is my IKEA um, DIY trolley. This actually comes in a set. I got it from Shopee, and uh, like this is this is not a hair dryer. Guys, uh, this it's things that I get to hang, and then I really like this area as well. I've also organized my um, washi tape and this box and I've organized my acrylic that I don't really use often because it was like very hidden previously and I totally forgot like like the problem about me is that I have a lot of supplies but they are always hidden because I don't remember where I put them or I just can't see them so I needed to get like I needed to see them so that I would able to use them. Hopefully this setup will actually remind me to use whole. Oh, we can see all the dust here. Okay, just proof that I hardly use them. <laughs> but I I love colors. I really like collecting them, but this is something about me. I just like seeing them but not using them. <laughs> also organize um, my stems. These are the cling on stems and inks and stamps and then these are the uh, you know what is it called acrylic ink uh, droplets I call it droplets um, yeah and and behind is actually like my plug point so that is well hidden here these are my favorite uh, sticker an ephemeral organization folder <laughs> I used to keep all this uh, in a box like uh, boxes of boxes of this where uh, I find it, it's very organized but it's very space consuming I don't know if you get what I mean because and secondly if I were to store the stickers like in different team like I used to do that like uh, these are the Ikea ones this is the China ones this is the cute ones this is the basic ones but I realized if I do this it's very organized it's I know it's some people does that it's very organized but to me 
uh, I it, it wasn't very convenient for me to take them out if I were to go out to journal because I always meet my uh, art friends where we would always sit down together and and we'll be doing stuff with our journals the all uh, all day so bringing these out it's pretty heavy and it's I don't know it's just not me <laughs> I, and I didn't like it plus it's it's very very space consuming right so I kind of remove everything and then move all them into folders um, it's just easy for me to go out like if I were to go out I'll just take one or two books that's all because it has everything that I need um, like these are just clear binder um, folder that I got from Shopee I think you can get from anywhere like Amazon or even uh, Muji does that to me uh, Muji even have like their kind of a dictionary organization uh, this is actually from Muji yeah but it's actually for a CD but the only thing about it is that it's much uh, bigger and I couldn't slide in into my IKEA uh, cabinet because the height of it was just uh, shorter and all this could fit. This is like, what size is this? It's like bigger than Midori Traveler's notebook. Yeah, they do have like even smaller ones but then I decided to go for these. And um, yeah, back to this. So this is how I store my uh, tiny bits of stickers that I think uh, I, I hoard a lot of stickers even that I don't really use them <laughs> but yeah but these are just like this so the this is the opening uh, where because it's, it's a CD folder right so yeah I kind of like I like how this goes because it's easily where I can take out and remove it and then put it back in because it's so convenient. Uh, where else are these? Oops, 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 hold on. Where these are not that convenient because um, the opening of it is different where you could you have to actually remove from the top or some of them like like these is a different um package that i got where i also have to remove from the top and then these are two pockets i have to remove from the side it's not convenient like to remove but well for space this is definitely a win-win and plus I can actually like tie them up tie them up and if and I can actually open these like I can actually open one of them to remove this and then take the stuff that I want or you can be even more creative like you can use like if you you got bored of it or you have extra pockets you can actually use this in your journal yeah or any kind of journal because it's just so easy where you can remove them yeah I actually have like a few of this where I actually store my uh, currency money currency <laughs> let me show you So this is my currency folder where I put my passport uh, but this is different because uh, it is a pocket, a zipper pocket so yeah you can uh, it lasts longer I guess <laughs> I will put like each country um, yeah if, if I were to go to uh, uh, this is an oyster card. Uh, yeah, it's from UK, London. So I could actually remove this and bring this whole bag out to London with me. <laughs> so yeah, this is how I uh, organize my stuff. I, I think I love organizing stuff. I have so many storage 
organizer boxes and stuff and some they are so empty I don't know what to put them but to think about all this storage right if you tend to buy more I, I realize I think it's like a psychology problem where you buy more storage you're gonna get more stuff like I'm gonna get more stickers I can't stop buying them I think I, I have a, an obsession with stickers all this while like uh like for instance station stationery i would know uh what that i don't like what that i will stop buying but stickers i couldn't stop because they're so cute so these are the um washi pet tape i guess no not not washi it's just pet tape so i kind of like yeah this is the one pocket pocket and this is the slide in two pocket and there's two there's even like four i don't know where is it like it's it's somewhere here um maybe here so this is the clear ones the four yeah this is the four pocket but it's extremely small i think it suits like things that you don't really have a lot like ephemerals yeah and it's not like double page this is one page so yeah i do keep my uh i, I really love this whole organization oh, it just looks so neat oh my god it's, i think this is very satisfying when you finally get to arrange everything in here god okay so the thing about this that like, it will come out and stickers and papers that I've collected for years, stamps, um, yeah, tickets, dried flowers, and um, rub on, alphabet rub on, more cute stickers and stuff, whatnot. Yeah, and this is the analog keeper paper from I think Korea that I really, really like. I wish to collect all of them. But yeah, this is not a flip through, but yeah, this is just to show you my current organization, I don't know, facts, I guess. God, I can't do it with one hand. <laughs> and this is what I meant, like I couldn't fit in unless I changed the height of it. But yeah, the thing about this cabinet from IKEA, I thought I could easily change it, but then no. I actually need to remove this to actually change the height, but then it's really really hard to remove this. So yeah, whatever. I'm like, uh, so I'm gonna just put it this way. Yeah, I'm actually done cleaning up and I hope you guys like today's vlog or an update in January. I'll probably post this on February and um, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!